that's the red wizard of jesus by the way not gizzard jesus it's like it's an older way of saying jesus like a jacket that's what we used to say so you ain't no wizard you're the wizard of jesus you're just a jizzer mate <laughs> you ain't no wizard you're a jizzer anyway i just feel like saying it i'm just going to explain <laughs> i'm just going to explain myself to the postman but firstly it's an olden days thing in case you need to go through it with your um with your fine tooth literacy comb working out how do you know what depraved I am. It's first of all it's funny for the post people. There was a thing on telly before how they find it more interesting to feed letters when they're walking around with stupid things on. And I've forgotten the legalities of writing on a letter but you can do all sorts of like we always used to do it as a family anyway, draw all over the post. But so I've done sender today. I've put on this. I've just found a book that I'm sending out to a little person, a different little person. You'll be able to see when it goes in the post because I'm only like rooting through it all. It's old Nanny Krampus because I don't know. First of all, it's introducing the idea of well, who's Krampus? Maybe we can go on Google and find out something new and interesting. And it's a bit tongue in cheek because oh, God, it's just one of those things where like, you have different manners in the family. And then to my daughter, I'm sending, because it's the Halloween pass, we got sent back before, but I did say they may be snowed in, I've not checked thoroughly the details, but it's colouring books and there was all like, um, what's the other thing? Power cups predicted, so if there are predicted, so that's a reading book for one, I've put a letter in saying, my favourite time to read was when it was snowy, and I made a bookmark. And if you read this with a name on it, if you read this book, you've put the dates on it, you become a wizard. Um, is that a piece of old paper? So she might get the idea to make a bookmark if she's not really thought about it before. And also the challenge of reading a book. I put, if you read five pages a day, that's 35 pages in a week. And that's a hundred and something pages in a month. And that's nearly half this book. And then if you do it all, you're a wizard. So that's that, doesn't that actually read or not really, and then I wrote a letter saying I read the book as well, and I had it since last Christmas, but I'm hoping to finish it by the end of February. Um, <laughs> so that's that in that parcel, in this small parcel here, literally approved, and I explained why it's got crumbs in it, because I read it myself, even though it's a child's book, um, which is true. What's it, heart clients? I read some of it into the internet, remember? Um, partly because it's, I don't know, if you go for reading material to children, it's not ideal that you've read it yourself but you've got some idea what it's about mm. and they can talk about it that's one thing and then this is the halloween parcel which i've sent to my daughter because she can be in charge of opening it i can't really remember what's in there but i wrote her a letter as well um sort of just touching on the fact that there was one news there may be power cuts and there's some coloring books in here it was meant for halloween and then i put on the back sender butternut squash eyed mother at my address because butternut squash is what she used to say for butternut squash. She used to say, you're butternut squash. Um, and it's a mixture of that between the butternut mother from Coraline. Because I am the other mother at the moment. So I'm the butternut squash-eyed mother. It might make her laugh. She might not get the, she might not get the, uh, what's it called? The lessons. She's also a wizard in training. She, she can be quite smart. She might have worked other things out but um i don't even know she hasn't got the patience for really. she's too mature now too mature for this nonsense ways so i've done that this morning um i've not wrapped up my father's present yet to send uber seat because i think i might go buy the silver brilliant actually um That was funny, wasn't it? I wrote, I had to get a job before I finished it all, and it got rejected, and he had to write, he had to write the other Lord of the Rings ones. That's a funny coincidence, isn't it? It was just a coincidence as well. A bit like, if you look through that when it's uploading, it looks like a shadow of Jon Snow over my cooker, and it says Pop in the cans. So he's my father, my father's Jon Snow. I don't know what that means. This bastard, probably. That bastard, John Snow, my father. I don't really know. It could mean anything. We've travelled down a Middle Earth wormhole. Um, and also, it was quite funny when I was doing Tarius today, reading the 
fast moving chariot energy. And like I said, tree, and I was talking about her and the hunter, and I agreed with that afterwards. And he, an oak tree came up, didn't it? The King of Cups. Why is it the King of Cups? Well, it's got cups on it, but aren't they called? Are they called a crown, aren't they? But it's called a cup, isn't it? The tree. But oak is. It's called the King of Cups. Um. Anyway, I just said that. And then googled her and the hunter, and he was in Berkshire. I didn't know, a ghost of, and um, whatever the park was. I didn't realise that. I thought he was just like a, I thought her and the hunter was just like Pan. Um, um, Henry the Forest. And he, there was an oak tree reference in that as well, Mickey. It's like, well, that's crazy fuck. Uh. Uh, and he rattles the chains and the ghost before there's a great before a king dies or there's a great disaster in the nationals <laughs> in the national paper in the national national community and I've been playing what I've been playing I've been playing um, I've been rattling the chain I'm a fleet with Mac I know it's a coincidence that's right I don't see which king now? I don't know if I lost that one. Right? No, what was it? That tune. Alright, that's it. That's all I've done so far today. I need to get to town and try and get this in the post. Uh, uh, I'll do something more useful. I need to get some stuff to clean up the pigeons. I just thought you'd like to know because I know you like reading for all my nonsensical ways and just saying I'm, it's this insanity vote. Um, rather than developing some sort of, you know. Anything. I'm really developing anything. I'm really ready. Right. <laughs> what do I know of the silver again? It's Sauron, not Saruman. Oh, I don't know what. There's too many words. The eye of Saruman. Saruman. Well, I've got the head controller. So, do you know what? I don't really care. I don't really care. It's got the eye. I've got the whole head with it. One thing. I pass it round. I really want to get rid of it, mate. Get rid of that room. I ain't got rid of that room, mate. It's, <laughs> it's a control box. It's like my Lisa follows you around wherever you're looking. Da -da -da -da. So I have problems. Mm, I don't know. There's too many words of things. Too many words of things. I've got this wizard thing too. This wizard thing. <laughs> it's a wizard thing. <laughs> What else do we just have? Owls. We just have those. We just have these actually as well. These wizard ball things. Oh, I can't do it with the poppy in front of me. <laughs> um, I've got this wizard tankard up here. Look. A gold one. That's another wizard one. That was a Charles and Diana wizard's cup. The cursed one. I wanted to keep it for that. I just bought it. It was in a window. It was shot recently. I thought, like, that's, you know, I was going through a phase of collecting cursed items. So I bought it. Um, <laughs> it's true. What else do you need to know about my wizard stuff? Nothing. You want to know where to take it next? Down a dark alley. I'm not expecting. I don't know it's going to happen. I'm. I'm a shapeshifter. I can be anything I want. I managed to gangle that in early. In fact, I think you gave it to me. Didn't you say I was a shapeshifter? You were orgiot. An orgiot fool. Yeah. 
Little Wizard's house. I made that. Little Wizard, actually. <laughs> and then swimming around for Wizards to live in. Oh, with those up and coming ones. What are they called? Not trainers, apprentice. That's the word. Apprentice wizards. Have you started reading Equal Rights yet? Actually, I've got it upstairs. I should be a new copy. I read it before though. I when I said I haven't read it. I did, I read it in my teens, but I, when I read it again this time, I didn't read it all. It was making me laugh. Because it was funny. I'm fairly sure that's the wizard one, isn't it? Are you quite right? I think. The last thing was a drum bullet did before death. Laid a burning hand on his shoulder to pass his staff proud of the ape son of an ape son. Unfortunately for his colleagues, in the chauvinistic, not to say misogynistic world of magic, he failed to check the baby in question was a son. Everybody knows that there's no such thing as a female wizard. But now it's done and happened. There's nothing much anyone can do about it. So let the battle of sexes begin. If you're unfamiliar with Patch's unique blend of philosophical bondage and or a threshold of a mind expanding opportunity. What? Say again. If you're unfamiliar with Pratchett's unique blend of philosophical badinage, you are on the threshold of a mind expanding opportunity. Financial Times. Persistently amusing, good hearted and shrewd. Sunday times. Well, I've got the flat page. 24. I marked it with, a, with some hand rolling wizard paper. You know why? Any wizards can roll their own cigarettes. Or smoke a pipe. I can't read that as well. I need to get... I feel like reading it and I want to go and buy the silver in just to have it uh, again. Uh, well, I still need to finish reading Perfume. <laughs> <laughs> so much to do. So much to do. I could sell them. Send the silver in to my father for his birthday. A lot of things, really. I don't think he's read it yet. Probably has. I have got like a holly rod or something, yeah, or a U one. The stones fell off it though. I've got a stone here. Look, my crystal tips. Sometimes it's easier to carry them around like that. The master. Let's play with sticks, you know. Let's play with sticks. Right, I'm gonna go. Do you know why? Uh, I need to finish getting dressed. Otherwise, you know what? I'm not going out of these stupid trouser bottoms. I need to put some tops over. And then. Get through the streets. Oh, what? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just going anyway. Bye, though.